Hello, everybody. Kind of excited about this video because I because I'm excited about tonight. Here's what's going on tonight. I've agreed to participate in this live comedy show that I really know very little about. So here's the deal. My, my buddy Graham Clark, who's a very funny stand-up comic, funny man about town, one of the top comics in the country, tours all over, headlines, clubs, festivals, you name it. Anyway, he uh, does this show here in town called Quiz Night, Quiz Show. Quiznos. It's not called Quiznos. Although potential sponsorship possibilities. I should have my people talk to his people, get a little kickback, get a little taste. Anyway, so Graham said to me, hey, you want to participate? You want to be a guest on Quiz Show? I said, you bet. I'll be there. When and where? And then it dawned on me later, geez, I've never seen one of these shows. I don't know what's involved. I expect it's uh, some manner of quiz. I think it's loose. I think it's a reason to get the comics together. Graham asks questions and we get to crack wise. I think that's the whole premise of the night. So I'm going to go uh, powder up. I'm going to go shave my face. Shower. I almost said shower my face. I'm going to go shower my face, shave my back, put on a lovely pair of trousers, maybe a nice top, show blouse. And then uh, head down to uh, the Fox Cabaret on Main Street for Quiz Show. All right, we're here. We're very red. A lot of red lights here at the Fox Cabaret, but uh, we're getting ready to do the show. I still don't exactly know what's involved in the show, but I'm going to go find out. I'm going to talk to Graham. I'm going to talk to other people who've been on the show, and they're going to tell me what to expect. Katie Ellen Humphreys, also yes, one of the contestants tonight. I don't know if we're... Are we against each other tonight? We are indeed. Head to head. Alicia Tobin. Alicia Tobin's in the house. Hi, Randy. How are you? Hi, I'm here on Wednesday. Hi, you guys. All right, we're here backstage. I still don't really know what's going on. I've been told there's some manner of a quiz. That's a, that's, that's, but I've also been told that's all I need to know. So we'll see how this goes. It's a funky room, though. I like what they did to the place. This used to be, a, many years ago, this was an old porn theater, I'm told. You know, they showed adult films. I don't want to besmirch the place but anyway um, I think five years ago or something like that they uh, they gutted the place and they turned it into a really cool uh, live show venue they do bands play here uh, a lot of comedy here Sunday night service is a regular thing here don't they Sunday nights I believe if I had to guess all right I'm here with Graham he hosts the show Hello. I've never done this before describe what the show is so it's it's my tribute to 70s game shows, 70s and 80s game shows it's all setups to make the comedians look hilarious. And you don't need to know nothing. There's no trivia. In fact, you may end up dumber for having watched the show. <laughs> I doubt that. <laughs> well, I don't even know what that number would be. <laughs> Sounds fun, though. It's Ivan Decker, who I thought I was going to be competing against, but I'm not. I know. It's so sad. It would have been so much fun. Two ultra-competitive people like us, it would have come down to fisticuffs. Yeah, definitely. And, uh, you know, I don't think I would have won. Yeah. I haven't, I haven't made, I haven't even made a fist in about 10 years. <laughs> never made a fist. That would be a great uh, character for a movie. A guy who's never made a fist. <laughs> the most peaceful person in the world. Just karate chops. <laughs> yeah, just karate chops. All kicks, all, yeah. all the time. Yeah. He's like the opposite of Iron Fist. <laughs> Uh, would you tell me, please, about the uh, porn pop-ups that your mom seems to get on her iPad? Yeah, sure. No problem. Uh, my mother is almost 70 years old, and she constantly gets porn pop-ups on her iPad. And she came up to me one time I was visiting her house, and I was in my old room. And she was like, Amy. I'm like, yeah, she's holding her iPad. She's in a onesie. And I'm like, what's up? And she's like, someone's taking over my iPad. As we speak, I look at it, it says lonelybitches.com, and she's like, How do they know I live alone? All right, the show is over. I lost to this dynamo right here. It was, it was close though, right? Yeah, by two points. Two points! Real horse race. <laughs> Real horse race. <laughs> a lot of fun though. 
Or yeah, they, nobody got hurt. Nobody got hurt, to the best of my knowledge. Driving back there, licking his wounds like me. I kicked the camera over. I feel like they got hurt. <laughs> It was a lot of fun. Uh, next show is November 25th. That's right. November 25th, if you're in the Vancouver area, come down to Fox Cabaret on Main Street for the next quiz show featuring that man, Graham Clark. Magical week.